the end of the crown game and rachel is a good person bad person what's up with her she said that oh bam is there and then and then the horn girl with the heel was like can i kill him and then rachel was like yeah well, it was kind of ambiguous, right? It's like, can I kill everybody? And the camera focused in on Bum, and then Rachel said, yeah. And I was like, okay, this girl's evil piece of shit. And then she actually gave a fuck. So it's like, what, 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 you're all over the place. And I don't fucking get you. The other weird thing is that the game suit girl with the red hair, she attacked Rachel first instead of Bum during the crown game. That makes no sense. First of all, Rachel's not even a com like a like a fighter. I don't think that it, like people are using the arg argument of oh she wanted to get rid of Rachel first and then focus on Bomb, but it's like I don't know. I think that was very intentional how she went for Rachel first instead of Bomb. Something is there. I don't understand why. It's almost as if she's been given a mission to hunt Rachel down. Who the, who the fuck knows, man? Now, nobody won the crown game. It was a draw. Bombs, Shinsu, Overflew, and the color was like gold. And there was a conversation between Yu Hansung and Leroro about how you should not be able to use Shinsu like that of your free will without having a contract with the floor's administrator. But Bomb is an irregular. That's why he can do that. Bro's just fucking built different. There was also some very interesting dialogue between Yu Hansung and Leroro about the existence of irregulars and the purpose of the test. Leroro is very wary of, you know, this is an irregular, Ivan Kill, isn't he gonna know? And then Yu Hansung was like, shh, 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 don't worry. The whole point of the test is to make sure that we can assess people like Bam to make sure that. You know, they can be, you know, pushed out of the tower if it need be. But the way that he was talking made it really seem like motherfucker is trying to smuggle Bomb in into the tower. Something was very off there, especially at the end of the dialogue of Leroro saying, is he just avoiding my question or is he lying to me? Stuff like that, right? There was also the discussion about other irregulars, Urek, Mazino in specific. He's just built different. He's just built different. He's, they're really hyping him up. I hope we get to see him, but this is probably like some end game shit. He's probably gonna be like a fucking Shanks like character in One Piece where like you only see him once every fucking five years, but whatever. Let's see what's gonna happen in today's reaction. Rahel and her stars. Okay. Where are they, bro? This part, it's outside a tower. A real night, Yoru. Bomb's name, Yoru. Real night, Bomb. You just left. <laughs> Cut the small talk, bitch. Come on, tell me what you want. Okay, Ku does not trust Rahel at all. Well, Rachel basically is the Maria to Bum. Just like how Kuhn got deceived by a girl and got backstabbed, and then the eyes, the same eyes that Bum had, Kuhn has. So obviously he's trying to be like protective of our boy, right? Why? Like, like... <laughs> that is interesting as well. Maybe because she can't fucking fight. I don't know. I don't think I've seen her really fight. This girl, why can't she climb with Bomb? I mean, Bomb is a fucking irregular. He has immense power. I, I feel like he'd be a great asset if you wanted to climb the tower together. Why you gotta do this alone? A burden. She's doing this for us and her sake? A burden if we're together. Because Bomb is way too dependent on Rachel and Rachel doesn't want none of that. What is Rachel dependent on? I don't fucking know. Ah! You mean you, not both of you. More flashbacks to Maria being manipulated. Gaslit. Okay. More Snickers? Give me more. Wait, he was eavesdropping? <laughs> You're too loud. It's not like I care about him or anything. It's so soon today, bro. We just got her Black March. That had our Black March. That's right. It doesn't care about you. 
Shibisu is gonna convince Black Mars to come out. Let's see it. <laughs> no, no, not even allowed to touch. Cause he's not cute like Bob. They, I, I think Black Mars only cares about hot guys. I'm sorry, Shibisu. You're, you're, you're looking pretty normal. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 Tell me, why do you need a sword? Yuri Zahad. How do you know that? Okay, more lore about Yuri here. What's it? Of the princesses of Zahad that chosen during the past 500 years. She's the only genius fisherman who was granted one of the 13 fishermen fish 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 what are we doing what the fuck is a fisherman i'm sure these are spoilers there was laurel was called a wave breaker yuri is a fisherman there is this Theme of water, which is Shinsu, but she's a genius fisherman. Who, she, she's really good at fishing, and uh, she got a 13 series. Okay. The fuck is a fisherman? Tell me. Why would she know so much about the Zahad princesses? Is she also Zahad Princess like? She keeps calling Ana Kakanisa Mona. Did I forget something last episode? Uh, Looking for the cho chocolate fucking. <laughs> Yo! Rack is going through chocolate withdrawal! We gave her all a rack chocolate! Look! Look! No! She's eating all a rack chocolate! This bitch, bro. Holy shit, he actually woke up. Yo. Five days. We're good, we're good though, right? Kun, you took care of it, right? Position selection. Okay, positions? Fisherman. Position. Shinsu theme, water. Fisherman, wave breaker, whatever Laura was. These are positions. Fisherman, spear bear. Oh, that's Rack. Oh, Rack is easy spear bear. Right? He has a fucking spear. So you have a fisherman. Spear bearer, light bear, no clue what the fuck that is. Flashlight, you have a scout, that's pretty obvious. Wave controller, that's what uh, Laurel was, right? Warrior frontline. Range, warrior frontline, now you got range. The fuck is a lighthouse? Okay, but I love the theme of the ocean, water, fishing, you know, theme here. Information about the situation. I feel like this is gonna be kind of like Kun's type, right? Gather and distribute information about the situation. Like Shibisu, Kun, I feel like would be good for this kind of role. Yeah, like strategy guy and being behind the scenes. Spy. Frontline kind of thief, kind of like a thief. Wave control seems to be the most giga role here. Laurel was one. Bomb is probably gonna be a wave controller. Fisherman, uh, we don't, I don't know if we have a frontliner. Kun is probably going to be light bearer. Scout, I'm not sure. Rack is definitely spear bearer. Cool. How many people are going to be chosen for the wave control though? Bum. They wouldn't. Rack cares so much. How many other wave controllers are there? They gotta be super fucking rare. Like, people don't even know how to fucking use Shinsu here, right? That's why when Laurel used it before in the crown game, that was fucking insane. I don't think anyone else can do it, so it's probably just those two that's wave controller. Is there any other sleeper OP wave controllers here? Yuga instructor is delayed, lucky. Lucky! 
It's almost like he's got plot armor. Fuck that bitch. I think. I'm not sure, honestly, anymore. Oof. It's just trying to protect everybody. New drip? Alligator pet shop. Ooh, headband. Alright. New outfit. What the fuck is your problem, bitch? Like... Like, I just don't understand. She makes me so frustrated because, like, she just, like, hold up looking like she's so fucking depressed. But it's like, at the end of the day, just, just talk it out with them and fucking move on. What the fuck are you doing? Just, like, being sad and alone and trying to be gloomy by herself. It's like, it's just pissing me off, bro. Michelle Light. This is not Rahel. This is Mihel. Or should I say, Michelle. She wants the stars more than you, bro. Maybe she feels guilty about what she's doing to Bum. What a homie. He's protecting us. He's lying to protect us. What are, you, what are you doing, Rack? Yeah, that's a good idea, I guess. He's found distracted from the issue. So what the Did we see this thing before? What the fuck is this cute ass little fucking thing? Have we seen this? No, it reminds me of uh, the Tokebi in Tokcha in. Omniscient reader's viewpoint in Gigok's video. There was a tokebi looking thing. What? What is this thing? It's like a little rice ball. Onigiri, new character. All right. He's teaching us about Shinsu. I don't trust this guy. Yo, red hair girl. I like her. I don't. Oh, she has the same jacket as us. E I E. That's the same logo as we have. Maybe this is like the default one that everyone gets if you ran out of clothes in the fucking tower right now. Contract in each four. So these are the wave breakers. Red hair girl is also a wave breaker, huh? Okay, okay. And the far back is the Hime. That's like the girl with like, oh, look at me. I'm so pretty. Uh, this girl with the horn is interesting. Her design. Actually, I think that's a guy. No, that's a, that's a femboy. Uh, the girl over here is a uh, quiet girl that teamed up with us by putting in her bag, and that's and then you know Mr. Nappy. What'd you say? What'd you say? Yeah, I'm saying wave breaker. So you fucking idiots will keep saying wave controller, wave controller. What did Laura say? You already formed a contract while you were asleep. I mean, he could already fucking use it before in the crown game. But, but what's so special about him? Is he from a special family too? Like, Kun, Kun's family is huge, right? Kun family is huge, right? Is he also from a huge family? It's like he didn't even know he had a contract. Oh, that thing from episode one. I remember that. Hit on gave it to us. Form contract with admin. But Pam doesn't need a contract. You smell good? What is this shit, bro? Did Evan give it to us? I thought Head on did. But okay. It's like an inner fucking beast. No, this is the admin of the floor. Holy. Is this ad Ivan Kill? Ivan Kill is the admin of this floor, right? No, is it different? There's an admin and what the fuck was Ivan Kill then? This I thought Ivan Kill was the owner of the floor, the admin of the floor. We're making a contract with the admin of the floor. What the fuck is Ivan Kill then? Floor root. What the fuck is a floor? Too many fucking things to know. Hi. 
いいだろうこれはお前にとって契約ではなく足かせだ Just for Bum, it's a shackle? Or for everyone else, it's not the same? Wonder if that wording was specific. He said we smell good too. Hmm. Alright, contract forms. This is a shackle. We could already use Shinsu freely though. I don't know. No one else is sweating like us. What the fuck? Everyone else is fine, but. <laughs> Bum and Loro. <laughs> Laura and Bum both could look like they're napping. The other girls, they seem like they were chill with it. That red hair girl, come back! Let me talk to you! Who are you? Oh, Riz? Riz? Yeah, who is this guy? Ho. Oh, alright, that's easy to know. Alright, bro's name is Ho. Yeah, why are you guys not tired? I refuse to believe that. We're probably more tired because we have more immense Shinsu mana pool compared to everyone else. Something about the contract. I refuse to believe everyone else is fine and Bomb is just the one that's super tired. No way. Can I trust this guy? He's being really nice. To the weak? You think Bomb is weak? I think Lara knows. I, I think Bro knows. It's like, you think that kid's weak? He probably has like a deeper understanding of Shinsu compared to everyone else. There's something special about him as well. He probably understands Bomb's potential and is like, Ho, you think that guy's weak? Like, look at yourself, bro. Oh, he was hiding it! Okay! He was hiding how tiring it was. Bro was hiding it. So, okay, okay. I wonder the red hair girl. But the other pink girl too. They didn't look tired. Were they all fucking hiding it? はあ、授業だるかった。何でもやりつかいの選抜方法。オールライト、レッツ。ハウズヨーエイムラック。ウォーザ。ダッガイアゲン。ダッツフロムレイチェルズパーティー。ダメ、オールライト。ユニカイ
スペシャルランチ大盛り肉抜き太陽他の飯は怒るって約束は守るスペシャルランチお待ち心がチクチクしませんここいいかしらおお、oh, you wanna sit with us エンドロシよエンドロシー name finally known エセサシュータイフェクター Friendless, make 10 friends within one week. That, that, the scout's test is making friends in one week.、Um, Shibisu, 25th bomb, which is obviously you know, his name, the 25th knight. Pon Sakal Lowry. Pon Sakal. If I Google Tower of God, Pon Sakal family, it's probably gonna spoil me, so I won't do it. Serena Linen. Kun Ho. And Dorsey, you gonna be Shibisu's friend? And Dorsey, you gonna be Shibisu's friend or what? So, I'm gonna be Shibisu's friend or what? So, I'm gonna be Shibisu's friend or what? Kun Sa. Well, Anas here. Anak is gone? Dissolve the Bushido, okay.、Oh, uh, Anak left us. Anyways, anyways. Ugly earrings? What did you just say about my piercings? Ugly? You think I'm ugly? Bob, you don't think I'm ugly, right? Ha! 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 This guy is giving me weird vibes. Oh, with the hats? Oh! Oh! He shot his shot. Shimizu tried his best. Alright, you can respect that man, but I think Endorsi is in a league that's beyond Shimizu. I'm sorry. Listen, I don't think that I'm worthy of Endorsi either. Endorsi is. Pretty, pretty good looking, though. I, I think Endorsi Bomb or Kun, you know, that's gotta be on that tier. Hots as well. Shibisu. Listen, you got Serena? You got Serena? Family. What is your family? Anak. Princess of Zahar has fallen. Two. Princesses of Zahad. Anak is a Nisemono. Fake for some reason. And Dorsey, genuine Princess of Zahad. Is this true? Zahad no Hime! What's her sword? Does every princess get a 13th series? And Dorsey must. Have one as well? I'm, I'm not sure. Casually mentioning you. By name, but they're not blood related. Just a big ass harem. Like, like the king of Zahad just basically goes around poaching and like fucking. No, no, he doesn't fuck him. He just like recruits really strong families, clans, girls, like the Kuhn family and Maria was strong, right? Stuff like that, right? He doesn't go around fucking them. It's just like, okay, you're born as a girl. I think that you can pass some kind of test, and now you are a princess of Zahad by title. We're sort of like brand name shoes put on display in the Zahad showcase. There was also a scene with her in a big、uh, closet of shoes everywhere, right? She loves fashion, she loves heels, shoes, but technically it's kind of ironic because she herself is a Gucci high heel for Zahad to flex.、Uh, these, all these Zahad princesses just objectified. 
What does Laure know about them? Rahel! めんどくさい女が。本日はゲームを行います。オッケー。ルールは簡単。人数が8人に配りした2ドルの。ですせ、フィッシャーメン?ゲームでの活躍成績に反映。ゲームで勝ち。いや。安全装置とかついてるの?
I, I don't mind really pretty girls that knows they're pretty and is honestly kind of evil like that. Oh, she would be fucking making a killing on OnlyFans with the Findom, bro. Why are you telling Anak that? Oh! <laughs> Everything she does is just so, like, I don't know, erotic. Like, like the fucking high heel on the face, you know? Everything about it is just step on me, step on me. It's just like this, this stepping on, you know, high heel fetish, bro. <laughs> Alright. Bye bye! Oh! Shinsu? Shinsu? Oh, Elfless. Barefoot. <laughs> what are you gonna do if you scratch this natural treasure of a face? <laughs> She is so full of herself. And like, she's not really wrong, you know? She is objectively very attractive. It's just the fact that she talks like this is dangerous, you know? She's just so confident. She fucking knows. That's scary. Oof. The previous princess was actually Anak and Anak's orphan as in daughter mom's dead daughter daughter hates princesses Zahat calls them all fakes because the mom died because of Zahat she hates the system she inherited the will Nisemono but here we go Nisemono there, was, there was mom right there クラウンゲームであなたを見たからゲームを放棄したの。ま、ある人に口説かれたってのもあるんだよね。どうして姉さんは不運な道を選んだの Niece, because they're all related, right? They're they're all related, aren't they? Niece. W what is a niece? A niece is a girl version of cousin. They're all family. Anak was family. I, I thought there. I this is by. This is Anak is Nesan. Yeah, big sister. I don't think this is blood related, right? Is is. This this is like by title, but that's why she's calling Nason, unless they are literally blood related. I think it's as simple as a title, sister sister. Exactly. I don't think they're actually blood related, guys. Oh, what's going on? Why is she in the boonies, man? Why is she in the bumpkin countryside? Oh. What happened to Anna? She's such a cute girl and the mom died and now she's like, I am an Avenger! It turned all edgy now. <laughs> married the cook who made best chicken pies. But you're not allowed to get married, right? Then Dorsey said it. And Dorsey said it. And Dorsey said, our family uh, romance is not allowed because you are simply designer shoes how dare you try to start your own family i just use you until you're pretty and, and young and then once you're old enough i just throw you away and we get new shoes anak decided to pursue a family outcasted and then did they come to kill her Jesus. whoa yo did he forget to turn the fucking oven off the chicken pies went too crazy here the fucking house is on flames because he the chicken pies, bro. He burnt the kitchen down. <laughs> Was killed by Zahat. <laughs> Other princesses killed Mr. Chicken Pie, burned their family down. Interesting. They're probably sent by Zahat as an order. <laughs> Damn, Sasuke! <laughs> 
Holy shit. Yo, so much Zahad princess lore this episode. Now we know why Anaka's called Nisemoro. Because she's not really the princess of Zahad. Her mom was when she poked up the title and Green April obviously listened as well. But her mom died because she pursued a family with the chicken pie man. But hey, you're not allowed to do that if you're going to be a princess of Zahad. You, you, it's basically idol contract. This is straight up K-pop, J-pop idol contract. You want to be a fucking idol? You better stay fucking single. And between the ages of 16 to 22, I'm going to fucking whore you out. Make a lot of money off of you. And then you're 23, too old. Get out of there that we recruit new young kids in. <laughs> you're not allowed to have a fucking family, bro. They're all designer shoes. Interesting. And Dorsey is very, very uh... <laughs> narcissistic. Confident, confident. <laughs> her national treasure of a face. How dare you, you know, try to hit it. But I don't see her ignition weapon. Maybe she's too young to have, you know, a princess series. Maybe the 13 series is only given to the top of the top uh, Zahad princesses. I thought that there was only 13 princesses because they're 13 month series, but it's sounding like there's more than 13 princesses and only the top 13 gets the sword and Yuri, you know, there was the accolades her being the fisherman, crazy ass shit, you know, getting black mart and she has like another sword as well too, I think. Doesn't she have like two of them? I forget her armory. Other stuff was Rachel's lore? Not really. Rachel's just more she's jealous of bum she sees that bum it's funny because it's night but the sun is shining down on him with the group of friends that's forming while rachel who is seeking for the stars is being left in the dark and the gap is widening but like bitch just fucking join our side you dumbass you're being so cringe. She doesn't know how to fucking make a friend. She's, she's fucking transfer ass student coming to a new school and being like, hm, I'm a loner. And she's like, you want to hang out with us? Come eat lunch. She's like, hm, I'm a fucking loner. It's like, bitch, fine. Be a fucking loner. Then eat your fucking chocolates and rot in bed for all I give a fuck. I hate her, bro. She's weird. She's, I don't know. I, 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 I don't like her fucking backstory right now. It's like, we offered you everything and more. And it's like, you're still doing this shit weird as fuck. Uh, we learned about positions. Uh, fisherman, frontline, spear bearer, ranged, uh, light bearer, lighthouse, box, computer, beep boop, beep boop, strategy, scout, make some fucking friends, and it's like information gathering, and then wave control, which is like the ultimate role of Shinsu control, and Ho, I don't trust Ho. Ho was being weird this episode, hiding his weakness in front of Bomb and then looking all jealous. I don't trust Ho. I fully expect that this these scenes with Ho today was kind of flags to for him to like backstab us in the next couple episodes, but that's it for me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.